Well, hello everybody and welcome back to my channel, Life with Patty. So I'm here today, you guys, with a Target haul. I went to Target today. I, um, it's my granddaughter's birthday today, but they live in Montana. And so I'm just gonna send her some stuff. I was hoping to go and visit. I was having lots of problems booking a flight or having super long layovers or whatever it was it just wasn't in the books for me so i i didn't get to go which i was really bummed about and i know my son was too um but anyways eleanor turned a one today and so i was just gonna send her some stuff from amazon or from kohl's or whatever and um just have it sent directly to their house well everything was really expensive or really a long um you know, like over seven to 10 days to get shipped there um, from Amazon. I know Amazon is really bogged down from this whole COVID thing. But anyways, I just decided, you know what? I'm just gonna go shopping myself. So I don't have the energy and the power to shop like I used to. I used to love to shop. Now it is a chore. So I went to Target and that's the only place I went. I drove 40 miles one way, <laughs> went to Target, got what I needed, and came home. I had all intentions of going to Kohl's and JCPenney's and the Dollar Tree, the 99 cent only, even maybe Michael's again. Nope, I saved a lot of money because <laughs> I just came straight home. Um, but I find, and I wanna know if you guys feel the same way. Now I'm in Northern California, but um, all the stores, everywhere you go there's just complete empty aisles or there's empty racks or there's just not the inventory and i don't know if it's because they're having problems getting things shipped from the vendors or if people are just going crazy and shopping because they haven't been out for a while i don't know but um there wasn't a lot to pick from although i seem to have found a lot <laughs> So, I'll show you what I got for Eleanor, and also I started some Christmas shopping because, you guys, I have eight grandkids. And if I do that all in November or December, whew. So, okay, let me show you what I got. I'll start out with that I got a new trash can for my bedroom. And um, so, I just loaded a bunch of stuff in here for it. And then I'll, instead of using a bag. So I got Ellie some little pants because they said that every, they have plenty of toys that she's in need of clothes, some more than toys. And I got her a cute little t-shirt. Um, I'm, was, they wanted mostly winter clothes, but I did get her a couple things that she could have for summer. And then this cute little shirt. And that was really all I found for summer things, I think. Oh, I found myself, as I'm walking out, I found myself a, um, a shirt. Just a plain t-shirt, but nice and comfortable. I love the V-necks because they're super comfortable on me. So if I find something, I'll pick it up. So I bought two of these surprise Barbie th um, blind things or whatever you guys call them. I thought it would be really fun if I have all the, if my son comes from Montana for Thanksgiving, that means I'll have all my grandkids. So I will have, that will be able to do the blind bags or these types of things. I'll have one, two, three, four, five, possibly six, uh, if my oldest granddaughter wants to partake, who's 15. Sometimes they like to do that. But anyway, so I got two of these to save out for that. And then two of the frozen ones. And then I thought maybe I should get three of each of these because my granddaughter that lives here would want to do it. But um, I'll just go back and get some. I wasn't sure after I got, I was like, oh, I should have got three of the girl things, two of the boy things, but possibly four of the girl things. So I don't know, I'll go back. Um, this is just because she's so cute. So I'll have her for the girls here for their um, little dollhouse. Isn't she so adorable? I think she's just so cute. I don't know why, but I do. Okay. And my son 
that's 35 now. When he was little, he loved micro machines. I don't know if you guys remember them. The little tiny, tiny cars, he loved them. And so look at, they had them in the, um, so for his son, I got these for his son. And these say ages three and up. So this is perfect because he's three and I'm saving that for Christmas for him. And then um, Kathy was, I was told Kathy, I'm at Target. She's like, oh, go to the dollar section. No, I'm not kidding you. I think they're doing away with our dollar little section because there was hardly anything. I mean, I'm talking hardly anything unless it's just that time of the year where they're in between seasons or whatever. I don't know. So I did find these cute little erasers with unicorns and rainbows and I might even use them for embellishments. Um, I don't know. I might use them. And then I asked my son and daughter-in-law what size shoes for Ellie and they said um, a size three. Folks, I could not find any threes. So I'm gonna take these right off of the thing here. Sorry, now I'm taking too long with you guys. But I found these, I know these were for 4th of July, but they're just so cute and they're size four and they're little slip-ons. So I thought that she would like those. Those are so cute. And then they live in Montana, Western, and they have horses and the girls like to ride all the time. Well, these are a size five, but she will eventually fit into them. Aren't they cute? And they do have the little uh, zipper. So cute. Oh my goodness. Too much cuteness. <laughs> and then I found her one more pair of little jeans. And then one more pair of boots in a size five. Aren't those so cute? And the little zipper again. So, oh my goodness. So cute. And then, well, you know, there's sometimes Patty's got to buy things for Patty, you know. And what does Patty have an addiction to when it comes to this kind of stuff? Candles. But it's almost candle season, and I've got to be prepared. Because I, I burn candles in every room when it's cold. Not now, though. So this one is Tahitian Vanilla. Mmm. It's just so wonderful. And then this one is apple cinnamon, which you know I love cinnamon. I'm not as big of an apple person, but this one smells really good. And then this one is mandarin berry. So, and are these pretty jars? Like, I don't know, it's got the lid and everything. So afterwards you could save it and I could put craft stuff in it, like buttons and stuff. It's really, they're really pretty. So those were, those were much needed, you know. All right, then let's continue on. Oh, I found this for Eleanor. So it's a double set of pajamas with the unicorn. So there's one shirt and then there's the other shirt. And then it has, of course, the pajama pants. and then the pajama pants. So, everybody always needs pajamas, right? Oh, I guess I bought her two. <laughs> so here's some more pajamas, and that's a little koala bear. And then on this side, it says loved. So she's got four pair of pajamas, so that'll keep her stocked up for a while in pajamas. I don't know why I don't are any of you other grandmas out there the type that always have to send little um, snacks for your grandkids even though like they can go to the grocery store <laughs> so I got them the individual little packets of the goldfish crackers in the rainbow colors because there's three of them there's Eleanor and her two sisters you know and then I also got them some big chewy granola bars. So I'll send those to them. What is this? It's so heavy. Oh, 
So I've come to the conclusion now, just wherever I go, if I see hand sanitizer, I get it. Antibacterial hand sanitizer, this was $5.95. And then they had the little travel size for $2.95. Uh, I'll just refill my, my travel size. All right. One more Christmas present for my three-year-old grandson, but I'll give him this. Um, and he'll be almost, well, no, he'll be three and a half. And this is for four plus. So I might even just save this for his um, fourth birthday. I don't know. So I'll ask my son if he's good about the little pieces. So, but this was like the other micro machines, like these little guys. So they reminded me of my son. So I got them for his son. And then, oh, look at this dress. Look at this dress. So they had the pinky pink one. But then I, I just love this one, the blue. Isn't that cute? So there's the top. And that's the bottom. <laughs> I just thought it was so adorable. It's just so cute. You know, I had all boys. So now that I have granddaughters, so much fun. Okay. And then, you know, Montana gets really cold. So this is corduroy, but it's a little... Um, Here's the front, I think, yeah. Look at it's got the little zipper in the front and the cheetah print and then the little shirt. So it's, you know, it's kind of warm, but they need it back there because it's it snows and gets super cold. And then this one, this is what I mean, they didn't have a lot of like, to me, really cutesy things, um, but their inventory was just down, but I just didn't feel like going anywhere else. So I made it work. So there is the other skirt, and then it's got little ruffles, and then this like peach colored shirt. And I have one more. And this is like a romper, but I thought it was adorable. So there it is. And it's, see? And I just thought that was so cute. So I will send that off to Ellie on Monday. And she'll get grandma's presents a little bit late, but she won't even know the difference because she's won. But anyways, all right, you guys. Well, I had uh, a nice time getting out and shopping and so hot for those masks, but you know, it is what it is. And no use in complaining about it because it doesn't do any good, right? So, and there was some, there was one family, they were in the shoe section with their little girl trying on shoes. <laughs> Some lady came over that was working there. She's like, you can't try on shoes right now. I don't know. But it did make sense. They said, you can't try on shoes, but you can take it home. And then if it doesn't fit, you can bring it back. Now, does that make sense? No. But oh well. There's not much sense to what's going on anyway. So you just have to go with the flow. You know what I'm saying? So I'm talking to you as I'm putting everything back in the bath. <laughs> so that I can put a box together later and get it out for her so all right you guys you guys have a great day take care be safe be happy be nice that's about it and come back come back and see me tomorrow bye guys